What's up, Team DMS? It's the Master Stylist, and I am back with another video. So I know I've been gone for a little bit, but you know, I'm bike, I'm bike or whatever. I feel like I haven't done a tutorial in like forever. How long has this been? I don't know. But anyway, I'm going to do a mold today using Main Mint Foam. You know it's the best foam and the only foam that I use and it is available at MainLifeStudio.com. I will have a link in the description box below for you to check that foam out. I am doing, uh, some people call it 3D waves. I've seen, um, but I do have a video on 3D waves. I've seen some people say it was curl waves. I don't know, but her hair is growing out and... We're going to cut it, but I don't want to cut it just yet because I'm going to use her as a model for one of my classes I have coming up April 22nd. If you would like to attend that class, you can click the link in my bio and go to MainLifeStudio.com. No, I'm sorry. Actually, I'll put the link in. It's a PayPal link. It's a separate link. It's not Main Life Studio. So anyway, we're going to make sure that we get that foam wrap Uh in the hair really good and saturated i may be a little bit heavy-handed with foam but it is what it is that's the way i like to use it so you guys just stay tuned we are gonna stick her under the dryer and i will be right back <laughs> So she is back from the dryer we're gonna go ahead and blow dry her her hair is already dry but I am just taking a blow dry and straighten it out some excuse my model she has a dropsies <laughs> I'm using main oil it is available at mainlifestudio.com it is the best oil on the market it's the only thing I use when I curl uh, so we're gonna go ahead and get started with the curling So these flat irons, these are a part of my main life collection. However, they have not been released yet. We have a little bit more. Um, they have a little bit more things that needs to be ironed out. And then they will be ready in about two weeks. So um, today is March 14th, I think. 13th. 13th. So um, they'll be... They'll be ready soon because I know somebody's going to ask me in the, in the comments like, where, where did you get the flat iron? How can I get the flat iron? It's because you guys skip through the video because you don't want to see the ads. So when you skip through the video, you miss pieces of the video that I've already talked about. And then you ask them again in the in the comments. So this iron is not for sale just yet. It is a part of the Main Life Collection and it will be available in about two weeks or so. So anyway, with this technique, uh, like I said, refer to my curl waves video. It's pretty simple. Um, looks a lot better on hair that is a little longer on the side. So this is like a great style to use when people are growing out their hair and still want, you know, that nice look, but it's, you know, growing out. So we're just pretty much making a full curl with the flat irons and then we're pushing them to the right or left depending on the direction you're going and then pinch and then i hold it down with my finger until the curl cools and it stays flat to the head i am using um that was care care's wax stick i know a lot of times you guys see me using bed head but honestly i kind of just go back and forth whichever i grab on <laughs> that's on my station so today it was a uh, character and also i've never used the bed the bed head on the hair i've only really ever used it um on the edges so maybe that's why i don't know but i'll have a link in the description box oh i just missed it <laughs> i'll have a link in the description box below to get that um uh, it's not that much um I think I paid like maybe $6 for it, so I don't know how much it'll be on Amazon, but there you have it.
So I'm putting a little bit more on the other side, the Care Care Wax Stick. Now, be careful using this wax stick. Um, I don't use it on everybody, and I really don't use it a lot, lot, because it's um, it's a wax stick. Wax is thick, um, but her hair is very coarse, and her hair is also very, very thick. So she needed, um, I needed something else just to give her curls like a more polished look. And um, it's easier to glide through the flat irons. Um, her hair is really, really, really thick. So I would be careful using um, this like on the hair part on everybody. But just kind of play with it. You got to see what works best for your client. There's no one formula, you know, that works for everyone. Yes. And I'm pretty much just curling the hair like a wave, which I'm alternating directions. But sometimes I'll have one or two going in the same direction. It's it's really just just freestyling. <laughs> again care cares wax stick just putting a little bit in the top of her hair and we're going to go ahead and get the curling now i am pretty much doing the same um thing at the top but because her hair is long and we're curling in different directions it'll look different um it won't look just like her sides but i'm pretty much using the same technique so to speak taking the flat iron as you can see and kind of doing the same thing just curling and then pinching um, when I get to the sides I'm gonna do the curls which will be my left I think it's your left too yeah to cover the parts um, I don't really like if I can help it I don't like my shortcuts to have parts showing so I'm gonna do my best to try and cover up those parts and um, it was it's much easier with her hair because her hair is thick but y'all just stay tuned, honey. <laughs> I know that was so ghetto. <laughs> but you guys stay tuned for the rest of this video. getting down to the nitty-gritty her hair is about 75 percent done so i'm doing the same thing that i did on the right side to the left side and it's nothing fancy same technique curl and pinch and we're gonna do that so we get all the way to the front and then we're gonna flip some of the front curls going forward uh back and that's pretty much it.
So now I'm just going to take my fingertips and we're just breaking those curls up in different places in the top of her hair. Now, uh, I wouldn't use a comb or anything like that for this part. I will, your, your fingers is the best bet that you can use because I'm not totally combing the curls out. I'm just kind of breaking them up. So now I'm going to take Kenra's wax stick and use it on the edges to get those edges smooth. Slick those sideburns down. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. And, you know, hey, when she lays down, her edges will still be intact. So this is the final look. If you guys like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, a like, comment, subscribe, ring that bell to get future notifications. I love you guys so, so, so very much. And I will see you again for the next video.